Hey guys, it's Heavenly Graphics here um, with, uh, I guess you can call this a tutorial. Um, I was asked to do a tutorial on the mosaic nail tips and um, I've tried to use these once or twice just to see um, what works best and I found out that um, either making a translucent um, acrylic color or using um, colored monomer works best with um, with these tips um, you can't I mean it, I guess you could trim them down some but because of how far or how the pattern is on the nail I don't know if you can see the bumpiness because of how that is um, I wouldn't recommend clipping it unless you're going to clip it um, in between the little sections um, that are there. So let's get started um, right here. I just have um, some acrylic colors that um, I made translucent myself and that's just by um, doing two parts clear to one part um, uh, a regular powder. It, um, it, it all depends on how translucent you actually want the color to be. I did it two parts. You could do it one part or three parts um, depending on what look you're going for. Okay. So let's get started and we shall see. Um, I'm probably not going to talk much through this tutorial um, only because it is late and both of my kids are sleeping and I really don't want to wake them okay so first I'm going to start with the pink and I'm just going to place it and let it fall into the grooves that's pretty much um, how you want this to be you really want to just place your color in the grooves and then um, use the clear to encapsulate the design so that's pretty much what we're going to do just making sure I press it down getting it in there so that the top part of um, the mosaic tile kind of shows through making sure to wipe all the excess off of my brush when I'm finished placing it <laughs> Of course, all you ladies that do um, nails are um, familiar with that, so there's really no need for me to tell you that this is extremely difficult to do with the camera directly in front of me. I don't see how you ladies do it. I commend you all. I really do. So if you see the camera move, it's because my chest hit it. <laughs> so I'm taking the blue now because I'm done with the pink. And I'm not making it even just because this is um, a tutorial. And I'm really not concerned with it being even. I just want to show you how to do it and how it looks when you're finished. And now with the green. 
and I'm sorry if my lighting is bad right now And of course, um, I didn't file the the tip of the nail just because, like I said, this is for demonstration purposes. But um, when you put them on, make sure to do that. Okay, so now I want to make sure that all of the color is completely out of my brush. And I'm just going to take the clear. and start encapsulating it okay so when I come back um, or I guess I could just do it on here it's really not that much you all know how to encapsulate just gonna make sure it's even and with this one um, you want to make sure that it's high up enough so that it covers the grooves that are on the nail. And I am not doing a very good job because I can't see. And this is, um, the colors that I've used are from Diva DC and so is the clear powder that I'm using and the monomer that's all Diva DC products And if you hear that TV in the background, it's because my daughter needs the TV to go to sleep. So she has the TV on. And I'm using the wrong brush for my encapsulation I use a 14 brush so this is a little weird to me because this brush is extremely small and I'm as you can see I'm not doing the nail bed just because I just want to show you all what it looks like and that is what it looks like as you can see you can see through it and then once you file and buff and put your top coat on um, it'll have a much prettier effect um, I guess I can do that so I'll finish encapsulating this nail and then um, come back and show you once it's filed and buffed Okay guys, so I'm back and um, I have filed, buffed, and top coated the nail and that is what it looks like. Um, it's always best that you put uh, your, I guess you could put a coat of regular clear under the bottom because the nail is um, transparent. Um, and then your UV top coat on top if you want. But that is what it looks like once you have applied the top coat. It's actually a, a pretty, um, you know, it, a pretty cool effect. Um, 
you can see that it is see-through but there is color so it's a pretty cool effect um, especially when the light hits it the right way you can see when I move my hand the light hits it a different way and it's completely transparent so that is that and that is uh, the tutorial on the mosaic nail tip um, please like this video rate comment and subscribe and I will see you guys later bye